Tell me again, why are we in a vampire ghetto after sunset? Be patient. Wait. Watch. Come on! This is the one we've been watching. Vampire in our ranks. This is a waste of time. Not vampire. Half vampire. Fewer weaknesses. She must feed. <laughs> Time to go. Where is he, bitch? Damn bloodsuckers. Careful with your relatives. They should have more sense. Thanks for dragging me out here. I just love the water. You're only half a vampire. A dip might hurt, but it won't kill you. So does sticking a finger in my eye doesn't mean I have to do it. No time for pleasantries. Just like your half-sister. I'm just confident in my abilities. So am I. But this is your first assignment for the Brimstone Society. So everything must go according to plan. What do we know so far? Fine. Newspapers claim the people of Morton, Louisiana are turning into some type of monster. They're calling them mutants. Doctors think a new disease is the cause, so they quarantine the area. You make me proud. There are numerous known biological masses in town. They appear to be the carriers of the condition. And that's where you come in. Destroy the sources of the infection. And as many of the infected townspeople as possible. The disease cannot spread beyond this village. Sort of a radical cure, don't you think? You'll be doing them a favor. In the final stages, their brains liquefy and run out their nose and ears. Hell of a cold.
One of the biological masses was found at the end of this road, in a graveyard behind the church. We'll meet up there. What's that mound by the telephone pole? What is it? It is, was, human. Might be remains from the final stages of the disease, but there's something not quite right about it. Let's check inside. Hmm, seems like somebody made their last stand here. Grab some guns if you want. Good thing we're not hypersensitive to holy items like some vampires. You should be all set. I'm going to leave through these documents. Maybe I can find something about past outbreaks of the disease. <laughs> wall stretches across the whole town, 30 feet high. I can see that. So? From what I understood, even the earliest French settlers feared something in these swamps. Feared what? What's this? After our dark year, in 1873, the first stone of this great wall of fortitude was laid. With this plaque mounted in the year 1888 of our Lord, construction is complete. May this wall of fortitude, with the grace of God, shield us from evil and keep us safe, now and forever. Seems like they built that wall for nothing. I'm going to see what else I can find in those books. You should take out those biomasses. The first one's in the graveyard. I'll meet up with you later.
<laughs> what the? Is that the biomass? Biomass. It's a nest. Strange creatures, aren't they? The strange isn't the first word that comes to mind. What are they? I'm not sure, but it seems they carry a disease that causes mutations in humans. The mutates? Right. And remember those sludge mounds we've been finding everywhere? What about them? Humans. Oh, what's left of them. The spider creatures regurgitate what they eat. The strange doesn't even begin to cover it. Hello? Hello? Somebody there? Open up. What, the morass was gone? Is what gone? The morass wreck. Swamp monster. That's what the Creole call the creatures. Are they gone? Yes, now open the door. Mon Dieu! Le Diable! Nice welcome for the rescue team. Who are you? I'm Jean Sigmund. I'm the grave digger. What happened here? I don't know. I hid in here when those, when those things came. They, they can't get in without them holes. Jean, you stay put. This place is obviously safe. We'll bring other survivors here. We not leaving? Hmm? Not yet. You'll be safe here for a while longer. Okay, okay. Send them here to Farmil to main mausoleum and we wait. If you find anyone that is healthy and alive, send them here. But don't forget about the nests. Seems like they built that wall for nothing. Maybe. Or maybe this time around, things got worse. These creatures are very insect-like. Seems every 30 years they swarm. I almost forgot. I have something for you. It's essentially a harpoon. It helps with feeding and has a decent range. Thanks. I'll protect the mausoleum. You go find those nests. I sketched out a map of approximate locations. The reports weren't exact, so you'll have to search the area thoroughly. Once you're back, we'll head over that wall. There must be some type of source where all these creatures come from.
You have a map. Check it to get a general idea of where the nests are. You might want to crawl back in the little hole. Get me hands on her. I make her eat her magic. Who? Marasa. Fancy's as Sef Marie la voodoo priestess. What about her? She hook up with the old German who came here. 
She go out to Bob Graveyard and she do black magic. And she's responsible for this? We, oui. She and the demon, scary man. Evil. She said she going out there to raise the mud of the underworld. Must be one attractive lady. You better get going to the female Tomei mausoleum. It's the only safe place in town. I will. Go to the Famille Termaine Mausoleum. You'll be safe there. Anything you say, just don't kill me. Merci. Oh, my God. 
die, you ugly son bitch! Oh. Easy with that thing. And who'd you call ugly? Excusez-moi. I, uh, I didn't mean to. Just go to the female terrain mausoleum. You'll be safe there. <laughs> well, I don't think so, you see. I got it pretty good right here, yeah. All the guns I need, and... And it's only a matter of time before these things find a way in. I did. And what if your ammo runs out? Well, maybe you got a point, but... Take your gun and go. The Gravedigger's already there. It's the safest place for now. Gravedigger? Jean's alive? My brother-in-law? All right, I go. <laughs> excuse me, my manners. Adieu, mademoiselle. Hold on there, mister. That'd be a... Deputy Gorham. Deputy Gorham, then. How about unlocking this thing? Ah, oui, bien sûr. Oh, so sorry. Say, Feeney. Well, I'm off now. Later, mon chéri.
That doesn't matter. Go to the Fumil Termain Mausoleum as quickly as possible. Daddy! Go! Dead. I need another one. I bet the car in the garage has one. Fall back in your little hole.
There's no dry land anymore. Back to the graveyard and meet up with me. Time to put an end to this. I'll find those bastards and rip their legs off one by one. Ugh. 
I lost him. Oh, it's all over. Look how scary. Into the line. Hmm, what if? Mother of God, what is that? Only one way to find out. 